filtering. Let me just explain to you what the difference is between dynamic active tracking, uh, cascade filtering and passive filtering. Most of the boards on the market that you'll find will have what we call passive filtering and that's basically what our entry level, the C2, uh, the E145 and the D145 have. Then we look at our top of the line which is what the A12 has, it's got the dynamic active tracking filtering which basically means that it filters the greatest range of uh, frequency noise. That can fix things like set top box scrambling, provides a crisper brighter picture on your LCD plasma projectors, reduces the noise that can be um, heard from hissing noise from speakers, thumping from subwoofers and, and other electrical interference that is fairly common out there. Cascade filtering is basically 20% less in frequency filtration than what the act dynamic active tracking is. And then the passive filtering is again 20% less, so about 40% from the active filtering uh, difference in what it, it can clean up. So the A12 for instance which has the dynamic active tracking, our DRM95 and our CM90s have the best chance of fixing an electrical noise issue.